been getting a ton of requests to do a cooking video for um, the Lean and Green meals that I make for me and my family. Tonight I am doing a chicken stir fry. Um, this isn't your traditional chicken stir fry. I don't do carrots, they're too much starch. And um, I only do a small amount of mushrooms because the boys don't like them, but they can pick them out because I love them. <laughs> um, very simple. I just add a little bit of teriyaki sauce, a low sodium soy sauce, um, some salt and pepper. If you want to add garlic, you can. Um, we're not big on a garlic in our stir fry, but it's definitely an option for you if um, that is what you like. Um, so this is basically everything that's going to go into my stir fry. I did two cups of cauliflower. I did four cups of broccoli, two cups of green beans, about a cup of mushrooms. I didn't really measure that. And I did about a pound and a half of chicken breast um, cubed up. Okay, I will go ahead and um, move on to the cooking part. Okay, now we're getting to the cooking part of the video. Um, I do two pans. I do chicken in one and the vegetables in the other. Don't ask me why. Some people just blend it all together, but for me, I'm just weird, kind of OCD with mixing my food until it's all the way cooked. So anyways, I'm gonna put the four cups of broccoli in here. The two cups of cauliflower. The two cups of green beans and the, about the one cup of mushrooms. Okay. Oh. Um, I definitely suggest putting a lid on this so that um, it steams it quickly. Um, we kind of want our chicken and vegetables to be done around the same time. There's your chicken. Okay. Now for people that are on program with me, um, you know that I always stress the fact of measuring out your condiments. Um, you have to remember I am in maintenance, so I don't measure my condiments always. Um, for some lean and green meals I do, but for this one I just kind of eye it. Um, so I'm gonna do a little bit of teriyaki. Okay, that's about a tablespoon, probably less than that to be completely honest with you. And a little bit of low sodium soy sauce. A little bit of sea salt and peppers. I like a lot of peppers. And the same thing over here. A little bit of low sodium soy sauce. Looks like I need to open a new one. There's some teriyaki. This will help the juices kind of steam everything once you cover it. Again. Some salt and pepper. If you are on plan with me and you want specific measurements for condiments, just message me and I can send you the exact recipe for um, our uh, weight loss part of the program. Now we're gonna cook this all down um, until, you know, the broccoli, so you can stick a fork in the broccoli. Um, you don't want it too soft because you are going to want your meat and vegetables to um, cook together for a little while so that the flavors all blend. All right, and there's some more soy sauce. Okay. Done. Okay, to me, this looks like it needs a little bit more pepper. Okay. So we're gonna go ahead and cover this, I'm guessing about 15 minutes, um, maybe a little bit less. 
depending on how high you have your burners going. But um, I'll go ahead and show you guys the final mixture in just a minute. Okay, dinner is served. Again, if you want to add more soy sauce or, you know, um, teriyaki, that's totally by choice. Um, I add a little bit of sesame seeds. Voila, dinner's ready. Enjoy.